Welcome to Free Math. In this video, we have got this uh, blue shaded scalene uh, triangle uh, ABC and this uh, right triangle uh, ADC put together as you can see in this given diagram such that uh, AC is our angle bisector. In other words, uh, this angle uh, CAD is equal to this uh, angle uh, CAB congruent angles alpha and moreover the area of this blue shaded triangle has been given to us as 6 centimeter square this side AB length is 3 centimeter whereas this side BC length is 5 centimeter and furthermore this side AD length is being represented by X whereas this side uh, CD is being represented by Y and now our task is uh, to find the value of uh, X uh, plus uh, Y in other words the sum of these uh, two side lengths please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe and please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale Let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, blue shaded triangle uh, ABC. We can see the area of this uh, triangle has been given to us as 6 whereas the base uh, of this uh, triangle is uh, 3. So therefore we are going to think outside the box and we're going to draw some auxiliary lines as you can see in this uh, next step. We have created uh, this uh, right triangle uh, BEC and now let's focus once again on this uh, blue shaded uh, triangle uh, ABC and we can see that this uh, CE is the height uh, of this uh, blue triangle and I'm going to label the height of this uh, blue triangle as uh, lowercase h and now our task is to find the value of lowercase h height and now let's recall the area of a triangle formula area is always equal to half times base times the height of the triangle and in our case uh, the base is 3 height is lowercase h uh, and the area is uh, 6 so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula so we are going to have area is 6 uh, equals to a half uh, times our base is 3 times uh, height h so therefore we could write this one as 3h divided by 2 is going to be equal to 6 and now I am going to isolate h by multiplying the reciprocal of 3 divided by 2. So therefore I am going to multiply the left with the 2 third and likewise I am going to multiply the right hand side with 2 third as well. And here we can see 2 and 2 is gone, 3 and 3 is gone. So therefore our height uh, lowercase h uh, equals to, if we simplify this part, uh, that is going to give us simply 4 centimeter. So thus our height uh, h turns out to be 4 centimeter. In other words, our this side uh, CE length is 4 centimeter. And now let's focus on this uh, right triangle BEC whose uh, side lengths are uh, 5 and 4. And now let's recall the Pythagorean triplets uh, 3, 4, 5. And here we can see our two side lengths are 4 and 5. So therefore we conclude uh, that this uh, unknown side length has got to be 3 centimeter. So thus we conclude that our uh, this uh, segment uh, BE length is 3 cm. So therefore this whole uh, side AE length has got to be 3 plus 3 is going to give us uh, 6 cm. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, right triangle uh, ACD and this uh, other right triangle uh, AEC. So therefore we could see that both uh, right triangles, uh, right triangle ADC and the other right triangle ACEC are our congruent uh, triangles according to angle side angle congruency theorem. Since uh, these angles are uh, congruent, 
this angle is 90 degrees and likewise this angle is 90 degrees as well and this side AC is in common for both of these triangles and now let's make an observation we could see that this uh, side AD is going to be equal to this side AE since uh, these two triangles are congruent as you can see in this equation AD equals to AE and likewise uh, this uh, side uh, CD length is going to be equal to this side uh, CE as you can see in this uh, another equation CD equals to CE now let's make an observation we can see that this uh, AD length is being represented by X and likewise this uh, AE length is uh, 6 so therefore this equation could be written as uh, X uh, equals to 6 uh, centimeter value and likewise uh, this uh, CD length uh, is being uh, represented by Y and this uh, side uh, CE length is 4 so therefore this equation is going to become Y equals to 4 centimeter and here's our final step now we are going to find the value of X plus Y and we already figured out our x value as 6 and y value as 4. So therefore uh, x uh, plus y value has got to be 6 uh, plus uh, 4. So therefore our x uh, plus y value is going to be 10 centimeter. So thus after all the calculations and manipulations our x plus y value turns out to be 10 centimeter. In other words, uh, x plus y value is going to be 10 centimeter. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.